Hello friends, this is Ramana. In this demo, I will show how to update a table data with variable using Azure SQL task. So first I will show my table data. This is my EMP data, which contains ID, name and high date. Now I want to change, I want to update the values of the name column, name column and higher date column for employee ID 3. So name actually it is Bob Johnson. I, I want to add William Bob Johnson name and uh, higher date I want to change it from existing March 10th to February 10th. I want to change the month for employee ID 3. So for employee ID 3, I want to make changes for two columns. So this is, I will do these changes by using Execute SQL task. Before that, you need to create one variable. So make this variable name in ID and give the value. So I want to update the value for employee ID 3. So that I am giving the value for employee ID 3. Okay. Now drag the execute SQL task. Double click. So here keep the result set as none as it is. And coming to, so since my table EMP data is in sample underscore database, I am selecting the sample underscore database and click OK. So here you need to write the update sheet. So update what is the table name EMP data EMP data set set is the keyword set name name is equal to I want to update the name as William Bob sir. William Bob Johnson I want to change the Higher date also. Currently it is March 10. I want to make it as a February 10. For that, you need to include the higher date in the SQL statement. Higher date is equal to just put 2023 20, 2, 10. So where? Where here you need to pass the value of the ID. So we already provided the we already created one variable called ID. So the value should taken in parameter mapping. I just give the ID with question mark. Okay. Update table name set and the new value comma. And if you want to update the other column in the same table, comma and may make the column name and give the value where ID ID is equal to question mark. Now parameter mapping. Go to parameter mapping, add. So here you can select the ID. This is the ID that we created at the beginning of the package and change this as a zero. Click OK. Okay. Now all set. So once again make sure I am running the query for existing table. Bob Johnson and 2023 March 10. So I want to make it as William Bob Johnson 2023 February 10. So I am going to run the package. See here, package ran successfully. Now go and check your table one more time. Here, William Bob Johnson and 2023 February 10. So this is how you need to update the table in by using Excel SQL. Just you need to create one variable and make your update statement. And with the, in where condition you have to put the ID with question mark. And while doing parameter by mapping, the value should automatically be taken from the user variable. So this is how you need to do. Hope this video is helpful. How to update your table. 
using a new SQL task necessary. Thanks for watching the video. Thank you very much.